Hi, it's female, and welcome to my channel. Hmm. My lipstick on my teeth. <laughs> All right, so uh, I have a Dollar Tree haul for you guys. Um, now, I had made two videos last week, okay? And once again, the video didn't get uh, uh, processed. Um, and um i don't i don't understand you know what the heck is going on um you have people saying far worse things than what i'm saying and so um i don't know so i guess they just telling me shut up and do the hauls lady <laughs> we don't want you to talk so anyway i'm gonna get right to it um this dollar tree haul okay so i got some slider bags okay did you hear that <laughs> all right i got some slider bags <laughs> and i'm just pulling stuff straight out the bag you guys and I didn't re try to redo the video um, because I had put stuff away and I was tired, so I didn't redo it. So here we go. It's a different uh, haul. Anyway, um, I got this pasta with white chicken, peas, and carrots. Okay. Because y'all know what I do. They didn't have the um, kicking chicken this time. So. You take these and you mix them with the shrimp. Mix them with the shrimp and you got a hearty uh, in the microwave for about three minutes and you got a hearty lunch. Okay. So. Um, got this box of deluxe macaroni and cheese. Um, I'm going to attempt to make dinner. I haven't really been cooking because uh, my back has been really, really bothering me this week. Um, I've got to get me uh, one of them um, support, back support uh, things, waist things when you lift stuff. Because I've been taking my mom to the doctor like twice a week. And so lifting that big... Um, walker that she has has really bothered my back this week so i'm going to the doctor at the end of the month to see if i didn't knock something loose or something <laughs> i've always had back problems um after i had the epidural so um this is to y'all young uh soon to be mothers um if you can withstand that pain of child labor, don't do the epidural because you will have problems with your back um, until the day you pass away. <laughs> okay, and I thought it was just me um, and I had made a comment about it on Facebook one day and so many women kept chiming in saying, yes, ever since I had the epidural, I've been having back problems. So, you know, if you can withstand that pain, do it because it's, it's um, the back pain later on in your life, um, you know, is really something else. Anyway, um, so I got two packs of these hand sanitizers. Now, I got these um, for my son. And uh, I got him a whole bunch of uh, sanitizer stuff because let me let me just brag on my baby boy, okay? So um, my son he went to uh, what do you call it trade school or whatever to be a diesel mechanic, okay? So he uh, has a job where he is doing the putting the bus together, the, the engines of the bus together. He's That's what he does. Okay, so he is like so good that um, 
his company manager asked him to, um, if he would go to Virginia, which I guess is their sister company, and help get those guys caught up, okay? So he will be going to Virginia. I think he leaves this Sunday or Monday. He'll be going to Virginia for a month to work um, there, okay? So um, they, you know, they pay for the flight, they pay for the hotel, they pay for your food and all that stuff. So, um, and he wasn't able to get his shot. So I'm really, you know, kind of concerned, but he's going to be okay because I told him you continue to wear your mask. Mm -hmm. Even if they not wearing masks there in Virginia, I don't know what their rules are. Um, and you know, social distance and all that stuff. So, you know, he's going to do that. Um, but I got him all this sanitizer stuff, uh, for him to have and, you know, for the hotel room too. So these little sanitizers are, um, you know, you open it up and it's like a little handful of sanitizer in there. So I got him two of those and then I got two packs of these and this is disinfectant, disinfectant wipe, wipes Lysol. Okay, name brand. So I got these so he can wipe down stuff in the hotel room. So and I told him, <laughs> I told him, I said, now you know, before you go, there are rules <laughs> that I'm gonna have to run down to you about being in the hotel. Because I've always had rules about being in a hotel because I have OCD and I have always been one that worry about germs and stuff like that. <laughs> so my folks would tell you, if I get the creeps, oh, everything, everybody must scrub down in the shower. Everybody, everything must be washed, uh, wiped down with disinfectant, okay? So um, I have rules that he, <laughs> he has to follow while he's on vacation in that, in that hotel room. Anyway, I got two of these uh, cracker snacks because this is what I snack on on my break uh, at, at uh, work. All right. Um, I got some olive oil hair sheen for my braids. Okay. I got these for my mom. This is... Uh, Scrub Buddies for Tough Cleaning Jobs, Quilted Texture, Wet Sweeper Cloth Refills. So I got her two of these, and you get 10 in this one. And then I got her two of the Brillo Basics, which is the same thing. You get eight in there, it's just a different brand. So both of these are Wet Sweeper Cloth Refills. So I got her a total of four of those to she was out of those so sit those right there some more um shrimp okay here's the other turkey and i got two of the ham and these make an excellent snack for, you know, when I'm at, at work on my break, because I don't want to get too full and then get sleepy and don't want to do nothing. All right, so then I got these uh, antibacterial moist wipes. So these are 16 uh, little disposable wipes for him to take too. And I know y'all saying, oh, she got him a lot of stuff. That's because I really want him to be safe. <laughs> <laughs> so it's these little toilets, you know, but they antibacterial. So, you know, he can put a couple in his pocket and some in his carry-on and then some in a suitcase too to spread it around. All right. So, you know, they shouldn't have a problem with this stuff. 
in your suitcase and stuff. Hopefully they won't. All right. And then I got him uh, this as well. Now I use this at work. Um, as soon as I come in from work and I get ready to set my my uh, little workstation up, I sanitize, spray my hands and sanitize them from touching the doors and stuff when I come in. So I got him a couple of these too. Okay, some more of the wipes. All right, and then they had these cute masks, okay? And these are the, um, like the doctor mask, but they are in different colors. So I, got, I like that one with the pink on there. It's uh, like a black, charcoal gray, and pink and white. So I got that because I wear these at work because, um, you know, um, I could breathe with it, you know, for four hours. Then I got this one. And then this one. So these are breathable and I don't feel like I'm out of breath. Um, because lately when I've been wearing them other ones, I've been making me feel real tired afterwards. So um, I found some uh, Buffalo Check uh, ribbon. Okay, for the summer. All right. And Ooh. all right, I got him some Cormex for his lips. Um, I got this for my uh, workstation at work because sometimes I forget to put um, some lip stuff in my uh, backpack. Um, got him some uh, deodorant. And I didn't know I had two here on the table too. Got him a new travel uh, toothpaste, okay, with some more toothpaste, all right, got him some power stick, uh, what is this, body wash, three in one body wash, I don't know what the rules are, if you know what the rules are, uh, about taking, uh, can you take this in your suitcase on the airplane? Is that okay? Or does it still have to be like a certain size? Is that too big? You know, what, what, what's the rules on that? I know some of y'all travel. I haven't flown in a plane in a very long time. All right. And then I got him some Tums in case he has a stomach ache or something. And some power stick in case the other deodorant is not powerful enough. Because <laughs> I thought he'd be smelling when he be working on them buses and stuff. He'd come home smelling like Funky Charlie. I'd be like, ooh, you smell like Funky Charlie. Who knows what that what that uh, phrase is from, what movie that's from, a Whoopi Goldberg comment in the in the section below if you know what I'm talking about with Whoopi Goldberg say oh I smell like funky Charlie <laughs> all right so I got him some band-aids just half all right and then I got some of these hand sanitizers these are the little ones two fluid ounces he gonna be gone for a month, y'all. So don't talk about me. <laughs> and he gonna be well stocked with stuff, okay? And here's some more of the uh, antibacteria wipes, okay? And I know he gonna say, I can't take all that. He gonna take most of it. 
All right, and then look at these. These are cute. So I got these to go in the front yard. Okay. And then these, because um, after a while, those um, light things, they play out. So you have to get new ones. So the ones that I have out there now, um, I think they're playing out. And then I got him this uh, hand wash, Dermacil hand wash. So I got him that for his room as well. One second. Oh, I thought these were so, so cute. So cute. I haven't seen them before. All right. So here's the other uh, pasta thing. Because I put two of them together. So I'll be good and full. Then some more uh, Dista ribbon. Another uh, hand sanitizer spray. All right. Another hand sanitizer. I'm probably just gonna have him take half of those, y'all, because I know he will. I know he's gonna have something to say. I can't take all that. I know it. All right, I got another uh, power stick, three in one. Uh, what is this? Uh, body wash. <laughs> I'm looking at it going, what is this? Lord Jesus. All right. Another one of these. And then I found I found the uh flower things I was wanting. Flower signs. Okay. Fresh flower market. That's cute. Weed weed it and reap. That's cute. So I got those two. And then I found these. Mom, I'm doing a video. I will call you back. All right. And then I got these tangled up. Lord Jesus. All right, here we go. So they had these, which I thought was really cute. Farmer's Market. And then it has these things on there. Really, really cute. So I got that one. And then they had this one. The flower. And it says, we were meant to be. And then this one. Stay, staying alive. And that one's really cute. Oh, that one broke at the end. The little fork thing broke. But she did stack my bag. It's like I could afford. I should have told her I can afford to pay for another 10 cent bag. That's all right. Anyway, so got those. And I 
got these two of these containers you know for plants and stuff that's to go outside i got this to go with that barbecue uh stuff and i'm probably i i need to show it because that was in my last video and you guys didn't see it so all right and then i got these masks but before i show you that i got these just to um because i always buy this this is the only mascara that really makes my eye eyelashes pop out so i always buy this brand and then uh this eyeliner i always get that as well all right and oh he left a coffee cake in there this is from last week's and so another one of these that's for my desk at work all right so these masks this one is that color with the orange and army fatigue colors all right this one has like blue and what is that blue black pink some kind of blue a different kind of blue i mean and yellow okay and then i don't know why i got that one but i got that one and then another one of these because i only have one and so far down and um i was it was getting on my nerve flipping flip flopping from uh one <laughs> from one hand to the next <laughs> So, um, what is this? Did I show this? I think this was in that video too. The last time <sighs> was uh, this sign. Okay, enjoy life. You know, that's going for lemon season. All right. And then I got these masks, and I got some more of those little hand sanitizer things. That's for, for me. Um, got this mask. Now, these are really thin, so I can breathe in those, too. And that one. And then this one. And this one. Okay, so I got those. And those are going in my mask bag in my car. And then I got these flowers to go on a wreath for spring for my front porch. So two of these hydrangeas. Look at that. That's a pretty beautiful coral color. And then these roses with the tips have the coral in there too. So you mix those together and look how pretty that is. So I really love how they have really stepped up the game with their flowers. So um, oh. oh, my back is really kicking me out. So, I don't feel like getting up showing y'all that barbecue stuff. Uh-oh. But anyway, all the grill stuff that y'all been seeing at um, Dollar Tree, I got all of that and put it in a container uh, for my husband uh, to go next to the, sit outside next to the grill because... Um, I have bought some stuff before, but the last time he grilled, he just left everything sitting out. It's still sitting out there. It's been sitting out there for at least three, four months. Uh-huh. Yeah. So I'm just going to throw that stuff away because why he didn't bring it in so it could get washed, I don't know. You know, I don't know what the problem was, but um. So I'm glad it just cost me a buck, 
but I'm going to throw it all away. And uh, so I got new stuff to replace it. And I'll just, I'll go get it. Hold on. All right. So this is the container. I got this from uh, the 99 cent store. Okay, but inside, I got the big uh, spatula and the big tongs and then the big basting brush. Now, all of this stuff they had, like I said, at Dollar Tree. And then the towels, the um, towels, the, uh, what is this? pot holders and it says summertime cocktails and barbecue backyard barbecue food family good times and you get two of those and then I got this the kitchen towel and it says good times and grill lines so that's what I got for the backyard and um, I'm gonna be on him this year about making sure to bring that stuff in to get washed and then um, take it back outside and put it back in the container like it's supposed to and that way you can keep some stuff you know so I know it's cheap, just a dollar, but still. All right, you guys. So that is all that I have for this haul. Um, I don't have no story to tell y'all because I'm not even going to try to repeat the story I had said last time because they subject to um, – shut me down again and not let me, uh, you know, they won't uh, process my uh, video. So that is that, okay? But anyway, um, I'm excited for my son to go because he's going to be making really good money because, um, like, they doubled – uh, well, yeah, I almost doubled his salary for him to go down there and um, his hourly wage. And so it's a good experience for him. And, you know, hey, he's single, no kids, so he can do that. So I'm excited for him um, as well as uh, a little bit nervous. But... Um, I'm not too nervous because we we have family in Virginia. Um, my husband's family, uh, his uncle and cousins and stuff live in Virginia. So if anything happens, you know, he does have family that can go see about him before we can get there. So anyway, so that is a load off my mind. And yes, I know he's 22. He grown but that's still my baby. <laughs> All right. Um, and I feel the same way about my my oldest daughter. Uh, my oldest daughter. She's my only daughter, but I, she's the oldest child. And I feel the same way about her, too. You know, that's my baby. Always will be my baby. <laughs> so this thing is the grill cleaner so, so he can clean that grill real good with this here thing so that's gonna go in that container too so anyway i'm sorry i'm kind of slow dragging um like i said my back is hurting y'all but um so I'm going to go and put this stuff away, take my clothes off, put my jammers on, and then go ahead and get dinner going so I can relax 
um, cause every day I've been coming home, um, and I usually sit up in the den and wait for my husband to come home from work and we eat dinner together and watch TV. But this week I just, I can't, I just need to come, um, get something to eat and, or fix something to eat that's really quick um, and take some medicine and lay down, <laughs> you know, and rest my back for the next day. So like I said, I'll be getting it checked out at the end of the month when I go to the doctor. Uh, but other than that, I'm doing pretty well. My mom's doing pretty good with her, uh, her treatments. So that's going good. Uh, she has one more treatment next week. Um, and then we'll, they'll do some more tests to see if they need to continue with the treatment or some other type of treatment. So we'll find out uh, in the next week or two about that. So just continue to keep her in your prayers um, and say a prayer for Jordan as he leaves going for for Virginia that um you know he will be safe um for the whole entire month that he's there and you know he'll have a safe flight there and safe flight back home and um he won't have any problems while he is there so uh do that for me I would really appreciate it all right. So I thank you guys so much for watching. If by chance you're new to my channel, please hit that subscription button. Also, do what? Do do what? Do what? Do what? Ring that bell. You can ring my bell. Ring my bell. Ring that bell, y'all. You know what to do. Ring the bell. All right, you ring the bell so that you will be notified as to when I upload new videos, okay? It'll just pop up and say, hey, she got a new video. <laughs> All right, so make sure you ring that bell. All right, so I thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you on my next video, hopefully, if YouTube stop playing. <laughs> All right, thanks, guys. See you next time. Bye.